goat cheese is seasoned and then simply topped with olives, sun-dried tomatoes, figs and walnuts before drizzling with some hot sauce and a lovely sticky fig balsamic production. Welcome back to Cravings and Adventures. I'm Karen Ahmed. Just in time for the holidays, I'm going to show you how to make a delicious fig and goat cheese dip. This is a no-cook dip and you can make this very simply over the holidays. When I plan to have friends and family over, I like to have a few appetizers that are really easy to put together so I'm not spending a ton of time in the kitchen. Before I go any further with this recipe, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and make sure to ring the bell to so be notified every time I upload a new video. Now, let's get cooking. I have 300 grams of soft, unripened goat's cheese here. I'm going to cut open the package and I'm going to squeeze this into my bowl. My cheese is quite soft, but if yours is hard to spread, you can just zap it in the microwave for about 10 to 30 seconds. Before I spread it, I'm going to lightly flavor it. I'm adding one teaspoon of a balsamic reduction, as well as one teaspoon of hot sauce. I'm also going to add half a cup of finely chopped Kalamata olives as well as some sun-dried tomatoes. Mix this in and spread it in the dish. To top the cheese, I'm going to add a quarter cup of sliced green olives. I'm also going to add half a cup of sliced sun-dried tomatoes I'm using the kind that is bottled and floating in oil. Next, I'm going to add half a cup of black Kalamata olives. And I'm going to follow this with half a cup of sliced figs. I'm using a combination of Smyrna and Mission figs. For a bit of crunch, I'm going to add a quarter cup of walnuts. I've just broken these walnuts into small pieces. Finally, I'm going to top with one tablespoon of hot sauce for a little bit of kick and two tablespoons of this delicious sticky fig balsamic reduction. This is perfect for any celebration. Enjoy. Thank you so much for joining me on Cravings for Adventures. I hope you enjoyed this delicious recipe for goat cheese and fig dip. There's so many more ingredients that also go into it, which makes it super delicious. Before I leave, guys, make sure to subscribe to my channel and that you've rung the bell. And if you love my videos, do share them with your family and friends so they can enjoy all of these amazing recipes as well. And just for fun, follow me behind the scenes on all of my social channels. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter. Until I see you next time, do take care.